An electric go-kart is a go-kart powered by one or two electric motors and batteries. Many manufacturers offer electric go-karts. Topic: <laughs> Advantages, disadvantages. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Advantages. Acceleration is usually better than thermic model and the speed is sufficient for use on most kart circuits. Torque in electric motors are greater than that of the gas engine. They are ideal for quick takeoffs and off-road climbing. Electric go-karts are low maintenance, requiring only that the lead acid batteries of the cars be plugged into an array of charges after each run. Since they are pollution-free and emit no smoke, the racetracks can be indoors in controlled environments. Most fully charged electric carts can run a maximum of 20 minutes before performance is affected. An expensive alternative is the use of lithium iron phosphate lithium phosphate lithium batteries. They last much longer and carry more power per pound than lead acid batteries. Electric power go carts do not have hot engines or a tank full of gas which can prove to be safer in an accident. Topic Disadvantages Batteries are still very expensive and the autonomy is not that good. However, charging can be achieved in about 30 minutes and it is possible to swap batteries. Racing The ERDF Masters Kart Racing event took place at the Paris-Bercy Arena in Paris, France in December 2011. Drivers from different auto racing series such as Formula One, GP2 Series, WRC, DTM, IndyCar or kart racing got to compete with electric carts powered by a 40-horsepower brushless-type electric motor. There are a few other events for electric carts such as e-kart, a university challenge, also in France. In the U.S., the Red Line Oil Karting Championship of Northern California started hosting in 2013 a field of Eckerts Category V, Group 2, Class 1 competing for the Rattlesnake Electric Sport Championship. Most weekends, lap times were within less than a second of the fastest laps, with reliability much better than their gas cousins. In Canada, the G0 Championship Racing Series is set to start racing on temporary city street circuits in 2016. The G0 series uses all electric zero emissions carts built by EVC Racing of Indianapolis, Indiana, featuring a blend of parts used in motorcycle racing and new innovative battery technology. Topic: <laughs> France. Since 2006, an annual electric karting challenge is organized by associations and e-kart. This challenge brings together manufacturers, schools, academic institutions, electrical engineering. This competition is played with machines expanding from 10 to 67 kilowatts. It takes place over 3 days and includes many tests, endurance 4 hours, best lap times, acceleration from stop over a distance of 50 meters, 10 minute races. In 2013, the challenge has become international. It gathered 26 teams with 34 carts and 200 participants. Latvia, world's first In 2015, Latvian company Blue Shock Race launched new technology type electric carts. BSR 2017 Blue Shock Race Kart is first kart in world, which have changeable battery with small, extremely effective lithium battery pack, with one charge can drive 10 to 15 minutes. BSR 2017 Kart is most competitive kart in rental kart sector right now. World's first national electric kart championship In 2018 Latvia has become the first country in the world to officially hold the national karting championship for electric karts in classes Tech and Tech Open. The championship kicked off on May 1 on the historical Kandava go-kart track and during the season six rounds have been completed on different tracks in total. The Latvian Electric Kart Championship finals ended on the Jelgava track Rulitis, where the winners of the championship in the overall ranking were determined. The first champion to take the gold medal was Ricard Zerba, who won five times in a row. 
The second place in the overall ranking belongs to Rivas Vakesans, who took the silver, while the third place and the bronze medal belongs to Raistus Plux. Sixteen different races from Latvia and Lithuania participated in the competition altogether. In the championship all the races started off on electric cart powertrains made by Blue Shock Race, with a power output of 15 kW in tech class and up to 25 kW power output in tech open class. During the championship the best lap time was shown by Rivas Vakesans, 49.836 seconds. The championship was launched in partnership with the LMT Autosport Academy, which has been engaging in involving young people in motorsports for several years now. Thanks to the experience of the academy and involvement of teen technical schools in the Latvian Electric Car Championship, it has become possible to gather ten teams, which have worked hard on improving their equipment and have started off in the championship. Blue Shock Race is a company that has been working with electric carts for four years already, developing this technology both in Latvia and throughout the world. Thanks to the Blue Shock race experience, budget-friendly, technologically simple, and racing-friendly solutions have been created, allowing the racers to start off in the electric kart classes. Since another World's Electric Kart Championship was launched in Germany on May 13, now both of these countries, Latvia and Germany, can be considered as pioneers when it comes to holding national electric kart championships, and in fact, both countries deserve to bear the title of the first championship. Currently Blue Shock Race is working on the development of new racing carts with a maximum output up to 55 kW with an ultimate racing capacity that can accelerate to 100 km per hour in about 2, 2 seconds, making this class an upper professional class. In 2018 FIA and IOC have introduced electric karting as the first motorsport in the Youth Olympics and taking it to the 2024 Olympics in Paris, that's when the Blue Shock race has set aim to go for the first Olympic gold medals in the electric karting division. After Latvian National Electric Kart Championship Stage 4 in Kandava Latvian company Blue Shock race launched new electric sports kart for professionals. This kart are capable to compete with DD2 division karts. In Latvia have tech open class where is allowed to race with 25 kW carts and in 2019 will be more electric cart divisions. See also Cart racing Electric cart racing <laughs>